you walk off your farm, you turn up in this place a horror zone for what? My sons were all killed in one day. I can find them. So, well, uh, what'd you think of this one, Grandma? I thought it was fabulous. By far one of the best movies we've seen. I don't know uh, how Russell Crowe got the idea, but it was just really, really good. <laughs> I was, I'm glad we saw it in IMAX, although I don't think I would have enjoyed it much less in, in the regular. But yeah, I think you're right. I don't know that it, I mean, it, it was certainly very pretty in uh, IMAX, but it probably would have looked just as nice in the regular theater. But even the concept of a man doing what he did and being able to track down uh, where his sons died, sequences were very realistic, I think, mm -hmm. and the actress was wonderful. She, <laughs> she uh, had her hard road to hoe there in her, with her life, mm -hmm. kind of split between European and Turkish. I wish I knew more about the history. I, I remember that Gallipoli was, you know, very, very um, costly as far as the manpower goes, that thousands and thousands of people on both sides died. I mm -hmm. remember that. Well, all of World War I was just horrible. Right. A whole, the whole generation of young men in England was practically wiped out. Mm. The whole generation was gone. It was the kind of warfare, hand-to-hand -hand warfare that uh, disappeared essentially after that. Even World War II wasn't quite that. What'd they call them? Those trenches yeah. that they made. And I really appreciated the relationship that he had developed with the, the major, the Turkish right. guy, who was pivotal in his success. The whole story wouldn't have gone forward at all if he hadn't struck a responding chord in the Tur Turkish guy's heart. You know, I just, well, again, Gallipoli is unique in that of the, the toll it took on Australia. And that it was almost all, all, all Australian. Australian and New Zealand soldiers. And so, again, I didn't it realize took a that. Unique, uh, I didn't realize that. Yeah, I mean, but her instant, uh, you know, when, when they first met at the hotel, she was greeting him, you know, as British. Mm -hmm. And. Her whole mean changed when she when he said he was Australian. You know? right. And I thought, okay, <laughs> what does she have against Australians? And then I realized they were the enemy. I mean, the real enemy. So, what did you think? Well, I too thought it was it was uh, it was fascinating. I mean, very, it was very um, interesting. Uh, it was really quite well done again to to um, accomplish really all that he did in a, a movie that's not even two hours long uh, I thought was uh, quite a, quite an accomplishment uh, again all the acting and, and the photography and everything was all you know wonderful uh, very well done uh, I think it was the thing that was 
was most interesting about it is that really, more than anything else, um, it was seeing the uh, the war and such through Turkish eyes, mm -hmm. where again perhaps people in Australia and Britain uh, have only seen it from that side, and so uh, I, I think in a way his search for the his sons and everything was just a bit of an excuse almost for that. I mean, uh, him being able to go and go through the countryside, get to know the people well, get to know their side of things. Uh, again, I, th I thought, thought all of that was very again, interesting and unique. Don't you think? Yes, very much so. I didn't realize how devastating the aftermath of the war was and to Turkey. Uh, they, they, they began talking about how, you know, the European nations wanted to carve carve it up, you know, mm -hmm. take this part, they, you know, the, and the actual warfare as far as the Turks just went on and on and on and on. And it was, it was uh, never-ending warfare. I mean, the, the way they sort of did it was, again, you didn't really know the whole story and, until the end like about exactly what happened to them. You, you you gained a little bit of knowledge here and there all through the movie until you finally get the whole story about exactly how, how it happened. It was very well done. I, I'm very glad that we went to see it. I think it deserved its award. Well, I am too. Again, I, I'm Why was it not nominated? Or anything in the in the Oscars. Uh, it wasn't released until. Uh, uh, it wasn't last uh, yeah. last year. February, right? actually, this month actually, I okay. think it was just released a couple of weeks ago. Well, I think that it's probably going to get nominated for some stuff. Well, again, I thought it was quite good. What do you think? Excellent. Excellent. Yes. <laughs>